If you're thinking of buying a new scooter, you might want to hold off until next year. The Ministry of Finance plans to offer a bigger tax cut to riders who trade in an older scooter for a new one. Early next year, a rebate of 5,000 NT could be available off the purchase of a new eco-friendly scooter. To stimulate interest in Taiwan's scooter trading scheme, the Ministry of Finance is looking into raising its commodity tax rebate from 4,000 NT to 5,000 NT. The incentive will be available at the start of next year at the earliest. Trade in old for new and you can save 5,000 NT. Of course, you've got to take advantage of that. The cost of a scooter isn't cheap. If we were to buy a scooter, we take lots of factors into consideration. 5,000 NT, what about the total cost of the scooter? Even if the incentive were 10,000 NT, we wouldn't consider buying. Opinions are divided. The trading program already offers relief from the commodity tax. Under the current scheme, trading in a scooter that's more than four years old earns a tax rebate of 4,000 NT. The new scheme offers an additional 1,000 NT for trading in scooters more than five years old. The benefit would be available toward the purchase of a moped up to 125 cc that meets 2017 emission standards. If there is an increase to the commodity tax rebate, there would be an increase in scooter trade-ins. Older scooters from classes 1 to 4 are still out there. There are currently about 8 million of them on the road. But the problem is, if you think about it, the price of a new scooter has really gone up. If you're paying 80,000 or 90,000 NT, then an extra subsidy of 1,000 or 2,000 NT doesn't help much. Dealers say the proposed tax rebate is too small to make a dent. Although sales and various subsidies can knock off several thousand dollars from the sticker price, most people will still feel a sting from springing for a new scooter.